as a subscriber to the Adobe Creative Cloud, I recently updated my Dreamweaver to Dreamweaver CC. And I was really excited about it, launched it, uh, go in to mess with one of my PHP database driven websites, and come to find out that my bindings and my database, uh, all my server behaviors and everything were gone. They uh, normally they come up over here in this area with everything else just in the default. Uh, I'm not personally I'm not sure why they they decided to take that out. I, to me, that's one of the biggest parts of Dreamweaver and uh, giving it its easy functionality to make it integrate in with the uh, MySQL databases. So I'm going to show you how to get it back on there. Normally you'd go in here to window and just pick it out of here but again it is not even installed in here. So what you have to do is go to your Adobe Extension Manager. Alright, so this is Adobe Extension Manager CC. Now, actually, I'm going to minimize this for a second. Uh, I need to close Dreamweaver before I really do this because it can't take effect while Dreamweaver is open. So, this is where you would install any of the extensions for your uh, your Adobe Creative Cloud product. So Dreamweaver selected. There's no extensions installed here at the moment. So if you'll just browse to your file manager and go into the directory where you have Dreamweaver installed, which if you're on a Windows computer it's usually under C program files x86 Adobe Adobe Dreamweaver CC configuration disabled features and then you'll just double click the depreciated server behavior panel support and it's going to come up and install the extension for you This dialog box comes up, just hit accept. So now the depreciated panel support is in there. And for you and me, that means we get our server behaviors back. So I'm going to go ahead and close these out and reopen Dreamweaver. Alright, so we've got Dreamweaver Creative Cloud back open and you'll see that uh, it's still not over here where it normally would be. So now to get it over here, simply go to Window and down here we have Databases, Bindings, and Server Behaviors. And then I personally like to dock these back down. the way that the way that they used to be the way that it's meant to be come on let's be honest that's the way it's meant to be so now that I have my database bindings and server behavior panels back in there I can go in and mess with my database driven websites again with Dreamweaver again I do not understand why they took it out Maybe if I did a little research, I could find out, but uh, personally, I, I really like it in there. If you like this tutorial or any of the other tutorials that I've done, please subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Thanks a lot.